as we know, predominantly is a labor intensive industry where you have printing mills, even textile houses in a five kilometer area, you have 100,000 shops or not five, maybe 10 square kilometer area. So it, uh, in such a small area, there are a lot of people working. So yes, time coming uh, forward is tough. But um, what we see is that uh, now people will try to adapt to new technologies or maybe they will find a better places where logistics and working is better, social or physical distancing rather, I will say, can be maintained. So right now the situation is very bad because Surat, as I said, is predominantly working with more labor and lesser space. But now they need to change and come up with better technologies wherever possible, distancing wherever possible. And I feel it can be done. Yeah. So uh, we were doing both internal and external discussion continuously within our team. We were trying to make sure our people's team stay motivated. And outside the team, we were discussing with our customers. We were connecting with them very closely. Uh, webinar is not so common in textile customers. So it was more over phone calls. They were discussing and trying to understand their perspective and what we feel can be the way ahead. So we did have a healthy discussion. And um, as we know, everything is going digital and we are purely a digital company in all the products that we do. So we uh, hardcore discuss about those advantages and they feel that digital because of these COVID situation can be the uh, future norm or trend coming in. So those ways we had a strong discussion with our customer and really felt optimistic view from their side. So short term, I know it's not going to be easy for anyone because uh, you can't adapt everything together in such a short span of time. You have to live with what you were living earlier and try to go one step ahead every week, month or every quarter. But long term, I feel wherever possible, I'll always say technology is the way ahead. We know labor cost is going to rise because of the situation that has happened. We know social distancing or physical distancing has to be done. Technology can be in garment industry where they're doing cutting machines. It can be in printing where they go digital. They can have more higher sophisticated dyeing technology. So everything I feel needs to look at a perspective of technology. And that is the only way I can see at the moment because COVID is not going to finish. Everybody says that it's going to stay somewhere around us. So at least for next couple of years, maybe. So we have to be adaptable to new technologies. That's the way forward. Uh, for, for the moment, we as a company uh, like to be in digital of everything, whether it's printing, uh, whether it's cutting, whether it's softwares, whether it is about uh, in future, we are trying to get embroideries also digital. So our vision is to be having digital of everything. And this COVID times will help all of the companies like us to push forward and it will help customers also to adapt new technologies. So printing is our core area, digital printing. We have almost 50% market share when it comes to uh, direct industrial printing machines. So there we have been lucky to hold such a big number of uh, share in the, in the industry. So printing is the core area where we can really perform well and we can help our customers or the industry to move forward. So I think innovation needs to be done at every stage of life. It's not about only technology. It can happen anywhere. So yes, I feel what you should do what the demand is and you need to do it to survive because now nobody is going to buy expensive clothes at the moment, at least they'll buy masks or protective. So yes, our customers have also started doing it. They, for example, a dress customer who makes uh, women fashion dresses. They are making similar type of mask for the dress. So it makes it look more fashionable. So they're trying to play safety with fashion. And with digital, you can actually print a lot of masses with customization. Each mask can be unique. So there are a couple of our customers who have already started using digital as a technology to make a more unique working with mask. It is one of the industry which is adaptable to a technology and it is when it adapts, it goes into masses. So that's what Surat is popular for. And I feel uh, Surat can really work hard and adapt technology and get better quickly on that.
with our products with the digital as a whole i will say rather uh, you, you can reduce on your dependency on labor which we know is shifting towards or remigrating and you can uh, uh, play good with the environment the environmental costs are going high and we know how covid has improved the environment so let's maintain it both as a uh, as a sole part that we should do for the nature and both as a cost part so, and even the efficiency with digital you print when there are orders so you don't have dead stock you don't uh, have those pressure to sell them at a the lower cost because i will tell you one thing dead stock is not only a loss to the person it's a loss to the environment because a lot of water has went down to make that dead stock a lot of energy has been consumed so you're destroying the natural or the resources and the money bought together i like one very important thing that at the moment digital has been good for manufacturers that from conventional they have went to digital no making of screen less water fast production when need you produce so it's all like that but for consumer he is still going outside in a shop and buying it he has not become digital only buying online is not digital it's digital mean what you get what you want and when you want so i feel uh, with digital machines people can go with the diy technologies where the customers can ask the design they want the fabric they want to want what product they want to make from that design and fabric so as you said the, the casual things are coming up so with digital customers can uh, customize and make what they want rather than what is available on the shelves very soon i feel really uh, because especially after covid these things will change because now you don't want to go outside in a shopping mall in a place where a lot of people are there touching the same fabric you don't know who has wear it so now you have to change it maybe online garments would be bought more but this diy technologies can really transform uh, how you said that you want to be now more casual you want to wear what you like and all those things can really make big change we live short life let's say 70 80 years but if we would have lived 300 years we would have seen a lot of pandemics lot of things happened in the past and today we are at a stage where we are doing things which nobody could have imagined we are talking about hyperloop going from one place to another so nothing is going to stop maybe it's a period of phase of year or two things should and will and will come to normal